The pursuit of a truly inclusive society is an ongoing journey that requires unwavering dedication and a profound understanding of the challenges faced by marginalised communities. It is a path paved with obstacles, deeply rooted in centuries of systemic oppression, discrimination and a profound lack of representation. However, it is a journey that must be undertaken with resolute determination, for it is only through collective efforts that we can dismantle the barriers that have persistently excluded and disenfranchised entire groups of individuals based on their ethnicity, race or cultural background. At the core of this endeavour lies a fundamental recognition of the inherent worth and dignity of every human being, regardless of their ancestry or the colour of their skin. It is a acknowledgement that diversity is not a burden to be tolerated, but rather a strength to be celebrated, a tapestry of rich cultures, traditions and perspectives that collectively enrich the fabric of our society. By fostering an environment that embraces and uplifts the voices of ethnic minorities, we open ourselves to a world of invaluable insights, experiences and wisdom that have historically been silenced or marginalised. The path towards true inclusivity demands a multifaceted approach, one that transcends mere lip service or tokenistic gestures. It requires a genuine commitment to dismantling the systemic inequalities that have perpetuated cycles of oppression and marginalisation. This means actively challenging and dismantling the insidious biases and prejudices that permeate our institutions, our workplaces, our educational systems and our daily interactions. It means creating platforms and opportunities for ethnic minorities to have their voices heard, their stories told and their contributions recognised and celebrated. Moreover, it is imperative to recognise that the struggle for inclusivity extends beyond the confines of race and ethnicity alone. It is inextricably intertwined with the intersectional experiences of individuals who face multiple layers of discrimination and marginalisation based on factors such as gender, sexual orientation, disability, socio-economic status and religion. By embracing an intersectional approach, we acknowledge the complex and multifaceted nature of oppression and work towards creating a society that celebrates the rich tapestry of human diversity in all its forms. Fostering inclusivity also necessitates a commitment to education and awareness raising. It is through open and honest dialogue, through the sharing of lived experiences, and through a willingness to confront uncomfortable truths, that we can begin to dismantle the barriers of ignorance and misunderstanding that have fueled prejudice and discrimination. By creating spaces for open and respectful discourse, we can challenge deeply ingrained stereotypes, confront unconscious biases, and cultivate a deeper understanding and appreciation for the unique perspectives and experiences of ethnic minorities. Furthermore, it is imperative to recognise that the journey towards inclusivity is not solely the responsibility of those who have historically been marginalised. It requires a collective effort, a shared commitment from all members of society, regardless of their background or privilege. Those who have benefited from systems of oppression must actively engage in the process of dismantling these structures, acknowledging their complicity and leveraging their positions of power and influence to create meaningful change. This change can manifest in myriad ways, from advocating for equitable policies and practices within organisations to actively amplifying the voices and narratives of ethnic minorities in various spheres of influence. It can involve actively seeking out and supporting businesses, artists and creators from diverse backgrounds thereby fostering economic empowerment and representation. It can mean actively challenging microaggressions, instances of discrimination and instances of cultural appropriation, and holding ourselves and others accountable for perpetuating harmful stereotypes and biases. Ultimately, the pursuit of inclusivity is not merely a matter of social justice or moral obligation. It is a fundamental imperative for the progress and flourishing of society as a whole. By embracing the rich diversity of cultures, perspectives and experiences, we open ourselves to a world of innovation, creativity and problem-solving that has the potential to address the complex challenges we face as a global community. When individuals from diverse backgrounds are given a seat at the table, when their voices are heard and their contributions valued, we unlock a wellspring of untapped potential that can propel us towards a future of greater understanding, cooperation and collective advancement. The journey towards inclusivity is one that requires sustained effort, ongoing self-reflection, and a willingness to confront and dismantle deeply entrenched systems of oppression. It is a path paved with challenges, setbacks and moments of discomfort, but it is also a path that holds the promise of a society that truly celebrates and uplifts the inherent worth and dignity of every individual, regardless of their background or identity. As we move forward, 
let us do so with a renewed commitment to fostering inclusive spaces, amplifying the voices of ethnic minorities, and actively dismantling the barriers that have historically excluded and marginalised entire communities. Let us embrace the richness of diversity, not as a burden to be tolerated, but as a strength to be celebrated and leveraged for the betterment of society as a whole. For it is only through collective action, through a shared commitment to equity, justice and respect for all, that we can truly create a world where every individual, regardless of their ethnicity or cultural background, can fully realise their potential and contribute to the flourishing of our global community.